Hello, welcome to Access. I'm Rob and joining us is Dave. Hello. We are playing Horizon Forbidden West, which is out now on PC. And I don't know why I've forgotten, Dave, but my God, this game is beautiful. It's been breathtaking. We've watched a couple of cutscenes before we started recording and I was genuinely speechless at that scene in the snow. And that was before this incredible view. I do remember this bit when I played it on PS5 and just my jaw dropping. But even now, it's just astonishingly beautiful. We're playing it on PC. We're playing it on Mac settings. We've got an ultra wide monitor that we're very excited to try out, which just means more of the beautiful world is visible to us. Yes, it's my first experience with ultra wide. And again, I mean, just like in a situation like this, where you're, this is the perfect it is. use case for it. Looking at the valley, I, I am genuinely blown away by how incredible this looks. It's so immersive. I'm immediately going to go and find the first body of water I can, Dave. Well, because uh, Horizon Forbidden West is, is my number one. Did you know that? My number one water graphics. You have mentioned it. Yeah, you have it's mentioned still, it. It's still at the top of my rankings. I think, I mean, honestly, I'm not surprised because everything this, this game does, it does with incredible skill and detail. I mean, this world is completely alive. The, the small specks in the air. Look at the grass. Look at the um, moss. The, that grass is Every unbelievable. Every single blade of grass. Look at the water trickling down here. I mean, really, this video is just an excuse for us to play Horizon Forbidden West again, uh, which is out now on PC, and just to marvel at how incredible it looks. I am probably going to be a little bit rusty at the combat, so this is going to be more of an exploration, an ooing and ahhing type video. Well, Ultra Wide is a, is a new mode that comes with the PC game, so that's why we wanted to explore this and take a look at that, obviously. You know, the, the the gameplay that we love on PS5 is is all here, but Ultra Wide is a completely new mode for the PC release, and I've got to be honest, it's an absolute joy. I just, I am genuinely blown. We're usually quite good at, you know, keeping a bit of a narrative going or a bit of a conversation, <laughs> but we're both sort of, we're sat oh, a little bit look. dumbstruck by this. It looks like you've already found a water source. I have. And I'm going straight there. I'm trying to avoid attention from all of these machines because I don't want them getting in the way of me just... I remember there was a dive button. Like a dedicated dive button. You're going to have to guess. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's I'm just judging. Gonna jump. I'm just going to jump, jump in. in. That's what you would actually do. It's like a lovely a bomb. Look at it, my God. What I really love about the water in Horizon is not just how it looks on the top, but it really sort of nails what water looks like underneath. Yes, definitely. But there's like a quality to the light that they've really just the, nailed. The dappled light on the on the bed of that river. Oh my god! It is incredible. The way that all of Aloy's clothing and hair moves underwater. I'm just sorry, I'm just gonna have to do a bit of photo mode because why not? I spend so much time in this game. I think this game also, not it doesn't just have the best water. It has one of, if not the best photo modes I've ever used in games as well. Yeah. Uh, you can get really precise with the camera. I love a bit of depth of field. Well, if you're going to have graphics this good, you should really have a way to let people capture them. Absolutely. Um, unfortunately, this will add hundreds of hours to your uh, playtime with Horizon Forbidden West, but... Uh, if you want to be a... Uh, if you want to do the, you know, the landscape photography thing, which I really enjoy doing, then... Oh, my God. Look at that. Look at that lens flare. Beautiful. It's, it's just so solid. If it's so... I mean, it's 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 got to be one of the best-looking games I've ever seen. Look at this. Fearless. Amazing. There we go. Right, more exploration. Maybe I should try some combat, Dave. What do you think? <laughs> I, I mean, I'm desperate for you to... Uh, it looks like you're going to be trying some that combat, one, to be honest. Yeah, whether I like it or not, because I've already been spotted. Right, into the long grass. I re ideally, I want to be stealth killing. So hopefully <laughs> it's going to come and have a little nosy. 
even okay, from here, the way blast. that water is just is moving. It's coming. It's coming to check me out. A bit of a critical strike. That's what you. That's what you're yeah, hoping for. Yeah, I want to sneak up and do a little bit of a critical strike on it as I make my way through the valley. Goodbye. Go. No, oh, no worries. worries. Wasn't a bad start. No. One down. His friends come to look. Do you think I go with the with the bow and arrow? I'm glad that you know wild boar and machine can live happily side by side. Oh, he's gone for it. Now it's getting real. There well, we go. that was that was pretty successful. I've got to admit that was you I'm know fair play. I'm pretty proud of myself. We've seen a, a few different styles of gameplay now. <laughs> that, that. Walking, sneaking, and shooting. <laughs> it's such. I forgot what a vertical game it is as well. Yes. And you do get up into those mountains. Obviously, you've got the the tall necks as well. I mean, the sheer scale of some of the machines in, in, in uh, Horizon Forbidden West is you know jaw dropping jaw dropping enough but now with the ultra wide as well there's so many different biomes as well i i want to get and see the different biomes so we're not going to make it in this video unfortunately but i mean you've got a good taste of of quite a lot of stuff here like a lovely autumnal valley mountains reaching up into the sky like the clouds all right later on in the game when you get to go amongst the clouds I also remember having the best clouds in any game I've ever seen best yes, water they are best clouds unbelievably good one of if not the best photo modes so here's the first settlement chain scrape it really feels like you know I can really see the the UI receding and just letting you Enjoy you become it. properly immersed yeah. in the game. Obviously, you can fiddle about with those oh. settings as well, but just taking all the kind of screen furniture away and just letting us enjoy the the world. That's still not the dive button, but that that water is unbelievable. This is what I took a photo Emerald. of. I remember taking photos of these plants, Dave. What when you per first played yeah. Horizon Forbidden West? This time you're just going to obtain the plant. It inspired me to be, to, you know, when I first played this, I wanted to start up an Instagram account dedicated to landscape photography in video game photo modes. Well, you should have. And it. I sort of want to do it again now I'm here. The problem is, it, people might not realise that some of these images are from a video game. It's just. I remember we did a little photo mode competition on the channel for Horizon Forbidden West and I took a photo I was really proud of like a silhouetted tree in front of a lake it was great well I, I was going to say it's 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 not difficult to take a good photo in this game and that is true but then but the, you know in, in as much as everything's so beautiful you kind of want to photograph it all but then with the amazing photo mode it does allow you to add so you know there's so much skill in the composition yes and then choosing the depth of field and the, the movement in the frame and the color the filters. I I would I definitely follow your Instagram account. Maybe I'll make one. Maybe I'll actually do it. I mean, this is just ridiculous, isn't it? Again, the clouds as well. They're not just like a texture plastered in the sky, like that cloud in the distance. You can see it sort of just sweeping over that sh the shoulder of that mountain. You can see it's moving as well. It's got volume. It's the way that, kind of like you're saying, I think, everything looks good from any distance. It looks right from any distance. There's de so much detail, but then there's detail in the distant, you know, that rock face in the distance as well. It's, it's detailed. Let me try this. Let's try and take a lovely landscape photo. That's going to be my leading line. The river going through the valley. A leading line? Yeah. Wow. So I'm going to turn the depth of field on. I want to focus on the plant if I can if I can nail it. So it's sort of there. 
Oh, you've got there's some butterflies hanging above it. That is ridiculous. There we go. Post one. Complete. In Horizon Forbidden West. It's just fantastic. And Ultra Wide really is bringing something to the game, I think. This, well, it's just more of the world, isn't the, it? The immersion that it gives you. Yeah, I mean, obviously, we've, we've seen a small amount of combat. I'd love to see how it, how it works with gameplay later in the game. I'd love to see how it looks with the different biomes that you've got in this game, especially when you get properly uh, underwater uh, further on. It's It feels like a reason to, to, to play this game again, if you haven't already, I think. 100%. percent Aloy is getting into a scrap. So I feel that's my cue to get out of here. Back to the safety of the beautiful grass. And speaking of getting out of here, Rob, I think we should wrap it up because uh, we're just mouth breathing into the microphones. <laughs> 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 and we're a bit a bit aghast. I'm not sure we're doing a good job today because we're just this is like it's just it's hard to know what to say. This is the this is honestly the most beautiful game I've ever seen. Uh, without a doubt. I mean, I remember thinking that when I first played it on PS5, and I think the same is, is still true today. Like, it is astonishingly good looking. And in ultra wide, it's just more. But it, it it really feels like it makes sense. Like I said, it feels like a reason. Oh my God, look at how you're just <laughs> making a path through that. We must get out of here, Dave. Uh, <laughs> we've got to wrap it up. Okay, we're wrapping it. Oh my God, there's a dragonfly. Yeah. Uh, we're well, wrapping it we've up. We've got an ultra wide monitor now. So if you want to see more videos of us playing uh, <laughs> quietly, <laughs> playing amazing games on PS5, PC in ultra wide uh, let us know in the comments give this video a like if you've enjoyed looking at the gorgeous atmospheric weather water effects in horizon forbidden west also let us know in the comments if you're going to be picking up the game is this your first time playing the game on pc or are you going to be playing it is this like a second playthrough or even a fifth playthrough on pc let us know uh, and don't forget to click the notification button and subscribe so you don't miss anything from the world of playstation thanks for watching